Hello, world. Patricia O'Connor and Frida Reba Dorothy here. This is how far we got before I noticed y'all were gone. Like, where'd they go? Anyway, it's kind of the weather. It's knocking out our bandwidth, and it just absolutely just knocked us right off the air. Could happen again. But we are on... We are on the end of this little repot. I think we've got it pretty well going on. If I don't horse around a whole lot, we may actually get this done. Let's see what we got. This is where I settled. Did I? This pot, this wide trunk, I trimmed the trunk a little bit. We had a little bit of, we had some roots coming up in here. And uh, I think that's just going to be, I think that's going to be very, very nice. What I'd like to do here is try to bring these little guys up, these little wires up. Somewhere, somewhere strategic through that little root mass, through our root mass. Everything does these guys I think that's a pretty good height I've been um, I've been kind of needing my work with, with uh, doing that better here recently but I'm still think I've got it this time I think I've got this tree at a, at a pretty good working height already Okay, easy pat. Don't go shooting off the light. Little, I think this was a good idea. We didn't bring back, we didn't cut back hardly any roots at all, except the stuff that was kind of growing up the trunk here. Uh, and that stuff wasn't long. It didn't have a whole lot of, it didn't have a whole lot of uh, stuff going on below the uh below the soil line when it came to that stuff it was just there bam Ur. i think i like that i do i think i like that now get the rest of our what do you think frida huh this is gonna be okay yeah Not n not nearly full yet, but I want to start uh, I want to start chopping some of this stuff down into there a little bit. Kind of work this stuff down in. Do that. Kind of get those roots in there first. So, uh, we had a lot of wind, a lot of rain, everything out there is flooded, everything out there is sopping wet. And uh, right now, uh, there's like this storm just pinwheeling right over Alameda. I, I keep hearing the word cyclone, which seems like... Uh, always associated that term with something else this is just for california this is some pretty pretty wet foul almost you know i don't know to me it seems like almost boston <laughs> almost like a boston winter no that's more snow i guess but yeah it's like 
It's like a good day to be a lobster fisherman or something. Except right now, the, uh, and then tomorrow too, we've been having some wind, and tomorrow they're calling for thunderstorms, and they keep saying that atmospheric river word, which is bizarre to me. A lot of wind, a lot of rain, a lot of water. All right. A lot of complaining about the weather too, evidently. Right, Pat? Uh, and it's not just us, the stuff, the stuff comes ashore here after we've, after, you know, I can see it pinwheeling out there in, in the ocean offshore between here and Japan. And you just watch it come ashore and it creates a lot of havoc here and creates a lot of water here, fills up all of our coppers and all of our, we've got, uh, lakes here that we haven't had in years or that. Uh, and then it goes through the rest of the United States and causes a lot of problems. So it's it's not just us going through this. All right. We're going to make a short part two out of this. And uh, I am a, uh, a good soaking away from having a good hosing away from having this guy being being repotted. I think that's a good choice on the pot. I think that's a good choice on the color for a tree that lives most, mostly in the water. Uh, I think that putting this tree in this size pot will keep it from getting too long and gangly and getting too out of, out of size. What I want it to do is establish some taper between here and here and I may chop it back. I may chop it back more this summer, uh, a little more. I don't want it to get too huge long, but that's the idea behind putting it in this pot. I think that all worked out really well, and I'm also looking forward. I'm also looking forward to having um, to having that other uh, unglazed pot for uh, one of my pine trees. All right, so that's us tonight. That's our big. That's our big soggy Tuesday night uh, at the bonsai balcony with Frida and Patricia. What we got going on? Like and subscribe if you guys haven't already. Uh, I suspect I'll be repotting some stuff from uh, for the next couple of days, probably. Um, and also, we've got a bunch of pine trees coming up, a bunch of seedlings to be checking on. That's pretty exciting. And so, yeah, thank you uh, so much for, for watching.